And what about on the, the finance side, the hospital system? How has it impacted the bottom line? So, um, you know, for us, obviously, the better the patient is, the, you know, the more money we get to keep. You know, in the hospitals, we have DRGs. So if you're coming with a stroke, you get a flat amount of money. If you stay longer than that, if you do other tests than that, it doesn't matter. We get the same amount of money. What we were able to do is to decrease the length of stay because we were impacting the care of the patient and getting them better and getting them out of there faster. The other thing that was important with this type of new technology, it was something called an NTAP, which is a new technology additional payment. So because it was so new, this was able to get that um, payment from Medicare, which was an added in increase to whatever we were able to get for that DRG, for the payment for the patient. And my facility alone, just here in Boca, has uh, been able to ascertain almost a million dollars in the last three years because of that. Now there's good news and there's bad news about that. Good news in that we get extra payment. Bad news is that we weren't managing our length of stay very well and our costs.